Hey guys, Carlos here from Angler's Lifestyle. Uh, here fishing uh, Quarry Lakes. We're at the uh, shore at the ADA Pier. Um, I'm here fishing with my friend Christy. There she is. Say hi. <laughs> She's so happy. It's been a while since I've fished with Christy, so um, you know I recommended for her to use that ultralight uh, rod or get an ultralight rod and maybe she can bring it over here and uh, show us uh, what that rod looks like. Anyway, um, yeah so uh, yesterday we were fishing here with my son uh, Ray and my wife Janet and uh, a couple of days ago they planted uh, uh, fish here the state planted fish here and they're you know for some reason they seem to be stuck here at the uh, cove and uh, let me show you a few of those catches that uh, we landed it was quite fun we were using you know our um, uh, uh, ultralight rods and essentially at first we were using jigs and you know ray caught a couple of those and then uh, at that point they stopped uh, biting the jigs but if you suspend the jigs um, using a float maybe about uh, 24 inches uh, underneath um, they started to bite that as well if you drag it slowly so let me go ahead and show you some of those catches all right Ray got one <laughs> all right finally ah. <laughs> good I wasn't sure if I caught one. I felt it with me and I was like, Here. that's a rock. And I was like, oh, that's a big rock. <laughs> well, there you go. You caught your first one. Yes, sir. So it's just a matter of patience, patience and chasing. Yeah. You want me to help you? You got it? He's just right there by the mouth. Yeah. Yeah. Excuse me. Oh, he cried. It's like you heard me. You heard a bird. Okay. All right, your first fish in like. 2019. I know. <laughs> All right. Yay. <laughs> uh, nice. Okay, here. There you go. So uh, yeah, the uh, the anglers were actually catching them with uh, with the uh, spinners, and that seemed to work uh, better. But you know, we were catching them as well using the mini jigs, and we were also using trout magnet. So stay tuned, let me uh, show you a few of those. He got distracted. <laughs> Wait, the fish distracted you, or you got distracted? Oh. <laughs> Is it a little guy? Yes, it's, cute. Uh, it's cute. <laughs> now we're gonna make fish tacos tonight. Apparently, uh, that's that's okay. the intention. And on three, one, two, drag. No, it's a good. That's okay size. No, look, it's, it's okay. Look, it's a streak on. Oh, okay. Lift it and bring it over. Okay. <laughs> look, it's not even a trout magnet. Look, Tan, it's not a trout bag, it's just a mini jig. <laughs> it's suspended it. with a float. Mm -hmm. What? It worked. <laughs> right? <laughs> Sometimes the man <laughs> and his brain. <laughs> Wait, let me get the. Uh... Huh? No, no, let me get the foresight. Oh, okay. Okay, ho hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. No, I'm just saying. I'm gonna get Oh, that's a good one. Pink one. Bring it over here. Bring it over here. Where's my, right there. The forcep is right there. 
Hm? The trout magnet, pink one. Yeah, so when it's uh, when the fish are actually stuck in the cove like that, it's so much fun fishing for them. Um, but I wanted to show you this uh, rod that I recommended uh, for Christy to to buy, and oh, it's sort of actually an equivalent of uh, the uh, trout though, the Berkeley trout though series that I'm using, the green one. But this one is yellow, okay, and it's pretty much the same characteristic. It's also fiberglass. This is called the Eagle Claw feather light and it's pretty interesting uh, one feature that I actually love about this uh, rod and uh, you know I don't understand why uh, manufacturers haven't done this but it's you know it's got actually a ruler okay <laughs> that you can actually measure your fish I think it goes up to let's see about the 24 or 18 inches long okay so anyway it's got the same characteristic it's a six foot uh, rod and you know ultralight uh, we uh, I recommended for, for Chrissy to put this uh, uh, stratus uh, what is this it's an akuma stratus okay and a three pound uh, maxima ultra green line and um, you know again it's the same action as my Berkeley trout though so right now we're uh, Christy is doing some jigging uh, it feels a little bit of noodly but i think it's okay i think it's the same action as my Berkeley trout though anyway so um hopefully she'll be able to catch something today but you know it's been really slow so stay tuned i caught one on a trot magnet with a little float like <laughs> on an actual you know conventional float what the heck <laughs> finally it's my first trout of the day <laughs> Yep, dreams do come true. <laughs> and there we go. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> see, see, Joaquin knows. I've been here for a while. <laughs> oh my God. This is my first one. <laughs> I feel so accomplished. <laughs> oh, Lordy. Hey Ray, drag the trout magnet. You know, but slow, like drag it. We may have to switch colors for you, Ray. Oh, wait a second, you have the jig, right? Okay, I may have to pass this to you. Well, look at this trout that I caught. He fought hard. <clears throat> there we go. Hey. Oh, wow. Nice one. Good job. Yeah. Finally, I got a good one <laughs> on a jig and a bobber. <laughs> oh. Now I got it.
What's that? Uh, no, as soon as it dropped. Ow, ow. How many did you catch, Janet? Two? This is my second one. <laughs> and that tore up my finger. <laughs> Ow. Wow. Boy, his teeth was like, look at that. Mm. An afternoon of fishing here at Quarry and we have nothing to show for. Uh, unfortunately, we even saw some of them uh, swimming along the shoreline, but uh, we didn't uh, get any nibbles whatsoever. I mean, thank goodness that I have some video clips to show you guys from yesterday. But one thing that I haven't showed you yet, and this one you have to duck for. I did. <laughs> See, it's that area. That's where they're at. Okay. See, uh, Tan and I was just, uh, whoa! Oh, <laughs> oh, I got that on video, right? <laughs> 3D, here we go, 3D glasses. <laughs> Good one, dude. Wow, that one almost took my eye out. <laughs> I had to duck when that, uh, you know, uh, lure actually came at me, so anyway um hopefully you guys enjoyed the footage that we captured yesterday you know maybe we'll get a um more fishing done the next couple of days if not maybe next weekend well i hope you guys enjoyed that so as always come fish with us sometime see ya <laughs>